All right, afternoon, afternoon. How is everyone doing today? So, all right, what's good? Straight casting. Welcome back to my channel. Basically, what I wanted to do is like to go for like a one or two trade for the week. So, I'm going to start off with one weekly. You know what I mean? So, I'm going to show like my initial uh, prediction and show show how that prediction plays out at the end of the week. You know what I mean? So, um, not saying that all these predictions will play out because you know that trading is a risk. So, disclaimer. Um, I'm no guru trader or any shit like that, you know what I mean? I'm just a regular guy, you know what I mean? I'm just an accountant. And trading is a risk, you know what I mean? So any trade that you take, it's at your own expense and not mine, you know what I mean? So once you get that shit out of the way, that's disclaimer right there, you know what I mean? Let's get to this shit. All right. So... What I want to look at for the week is like Euro NZD, yeah? So, we're in this downtrend right here, right? We're in this downtrend right here, right? And what happened is that this pre, when it actually shifted right here, retest, right? Um, price actually came up and broke this previous high right here. Price came up and broke this previous high right here. So it's a possibility that we could be seeing a, a trend reversal. So that is what I'm trying to set up for this week right here on the Euro NZD, right? So what I'm seeing right here for the Euro NZD, we're on the four hour chart, by the way. We're on the four hour chart, right? So what I'm trying to say for the Euro NZD right here is that in order to confirm that now we're in an option, right? Basically, what I want to see is that. This right here is a new low, right? So I want to see price come right about at this horizontal level right here. I would like to see price come about here, bounce, retest here. And once it retests here, not break this previous low, then we're going to set up for a buy. All right, so basically this is a pick for the week. Euro NZD, all right? So I'm going to draw that pad right now. Euro NZD. All right. I like to use pink lines for my minor resistance. All right. So I want to see price do something like this. All right. I want to see price bounce about here and then shift go up. All right. So when it bounce here, right. All right, so right here we have, let me put this right here, right? So it's a previous low. All right. Bam, yeah. And this right here, higher low. So if I get a higher low right here, right, that I'm looking to do some shit like this, right? Go, and go all the way about, probably about here. It is horizontal level right here. That's good enough. You know what I mean? All right, put that next horizontal level, somewhere about there. See that horizontal level right here, that price was respected and all that shit, where it actually consolidated right here. So process consolidating about there. So let's be a little bit more safe and come to about three, about here. 300, yeah, 300 pips, there about. And then now what I wanna do is that I'm gonna put my stop loss right below here. Right below this previous low there. About 34 pips, yeah, that's good, about, about 30 pips. Yeah, 35, that's good. So this is my prediction for the week. Not saying that this shit is going to play out, but what I'm saying is that if this pad play out like this, then I'm going to enter the trade. All right, so right here for the entry, when it, when it bounces off this horizontal level, right, basically what I'm going to look for my entry is a bullish engulfing candlestick right here. I'm going to go in for the buy 
from once price doesn't do like this shit but say that if price did some shit like this like bam and came all the way down here then fuck that shit i won't be entering the trade right here you know what i mean so i have to be seen in doing some respecting some basic of trading you know what i mean so all right so basically that's it you know what i mean so all right guys I um, hope you guys are ready for the trading week, you know what I mean? And hope you have a productive week, you know what I mean? A profitable week, you know what I mean? So this is it. Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share with a friend. And tell a friend to tell a friend, all right? Big up.